In this video, we're going to find the equation of a linear function in slope-intercept form if we know the y-intercept and we know a point that is on the line. So here it says, find the equation of a linear function whose y-intercept is given by 0, 6, and that contains the point 4, 9. And the first thing I want, to, want you to notice is that even if we hadn't been told that this was the y-intercept, we should be able to recognize that it is the y-intercept. So I could say find the equation of the linear function that contains uh, that contains horrible penmanship contains the points 0, 6, and 4, 9. And I, sh I should still recognize that I have the y-intercept here. And the reason is, say if we have the point 4, 9, which is going to be over 4, up 9, and then we have the point 0, 6, which will be somewhere in here, here's the line for which we're trying to find the equation, roughly speaking. And the idea is 0, 6, because the x-coordinate is 0, this 6 has to be the y-value of the y-intercept. So we're being given the y-intercept right here. We're being told by being given the point 0, 6, we're being told that b equals 6. And we know that a linear function, f of x, has the form mx plus b. So we've just been given the 6. So I can right away make that replacement. f of x equals mx plus 6. And then I need to go over and grab the other point that I've been given. I've, I've been told here that if the input is 4, the function output is 9. In other words, I'm being given 4 and f of 4, or f of 4 equals 9 is what I'm being told by being given this ordered pair, which means to find m, all I need to do is replace f of x with the 9, the output, because f of x represents the function output. So when the function output is 9, the function input is 4. So I replace x, which is the input, with 4 plus the 6. And now I just solve for m. So subtract the 6 from both sides to get 3. 3 equals m times 4. And then divide both sides by 4 to isolate the m. So we get 3 quarters is equal to 4 divided by 4 is 1, and 1 times m is just m. And so now I know the slope of the line. I'll come back over to the equation and update m. So I'm going to get f of x equals 3 fourths of x plus 6. And there's my equation in slope-intercept form.